guys, what's going on? We are still here on the Yankee Caps, as you can see, and it has been epic. Everyone is bent over on fish. We're having double ups, triple ups on queen snapper, scam grouper, anything you can ask for. The bottom fishery is amazing. And Rob has just decided to sit down and take a chill for a little bit. So now it's Austin and our turn. We are gonna go drop our own rigs down, see what we can catch, and once it comes up, I don't care what it is, we're gonna go back there, fillet it, cook it up, and see what you guys think of it, because I don't know about you guys, we're having an amazing time out here, and it's, it's a dream come true to be out here, to be honest, so let's get to it. Big queen, nice queen. Catch them all, Paul! Oh! <laughs> What's up? <laughs> this is one of the rigs that I've been using a lot, so I figured I'd show you how to make it. This is a 130 pound test line, 130. Take off about 15 feet of it. And if you come down here, these are bubble blade pliers. I got them at West Marine. They would be considered junk in my opinion. They barely cut line and they're a day and a half old. So this is gonna be the bottom of my rig. Start off, I'm gonna make a loop. This is called a perfection loop. If you, I, I need to make a video showing how to make all the knots, but the lead is gonna go on there just like this. Gonna slide on. There you go. That's gonna take it to the bottom. Come up about this far. That's a couple feet. And then, take your line and twist it, I don't know, three, four, five times, like that. Here's your little tag end, put it through there. Just like that. Always take your loop, make sure it's on the point side, goes through there. Then take your point, it's going to hook the loop. There you go. And now, this creates the circle. And that's gonna be an amazing rig. Just a pretty simple deep drop rig. And bait of choice today, I mean, everything has been botting the good old squid. That's what we came for. If we don't catch anything on the bottom, we will catch something on that weed patch. So now let it all the way down to the bottom. And once it gets there, you've got to pay real close attention to the tip of the rod. And you're just going to see a small little tap on the front of the rod, kind of like you're sword fishing. But it can be a little bit easier to notice. So you just pay attention. And once you, you see the bites on the tip there, you just turn the little dial. She'll start reeling up and you'll come tight. All right, so now I've just come to bottom. I go, I check my drag, make sure it's all good. Disengage my handle. And now I watch the tip. You can put your finger on the line to feel the bite as well, but it's been pretty good, so I don't really need to do that. Just watch the tip and wait for the bite. Every now and then, you might want to come back down to free spool, find bottom again. There we go, there's bottom. Come back up on your drag. Just be prepared, because those bites will come. Getting him right here. Look at that tip. Got something on, not too terribly big. And now when you're on your way up, you don't want to pull them up too terribly fast. You just want to get it coming at a good rhythm. If you pull too fast, you'll just wear a big hole in, them, in their lip or in their mouth and the hook can pop out real easy. So you just find a nice, smooth rhythm. Just watch that tip. Yes, yeah, sometimes they, they do pop off sometimes, but you just watch that tip. You can still feel the head shakes, see the head shakes, which is good. Now, I don't know what I have just yet, but what I think we should do, we have Austin Crocker drop one down, see what he catches, and then we'll do a taste test between the two different fish that we catch. I mean, good fish. It's awesome. 
300 feet to go. Now I'll just slow it down a little bit. And then, once I get it up close, oh, I'll go to double. How about that? There we go. What is it? Two yellow eyes. Yeah? Oh, one popped off. Oh, oh no! Pelican's gonna grab him. Dude. He's making it back down. You get negative points for that. Well, guess what? I got one on the boat. That's all that matters. So here's the scoop, you guys. I was sitting in the back with Captain Greg, and we were just having a good conversation. And I said, Austin and Jordan, go figure out something fun to make a video out of. Yeah. Drop a thumbs up if you like what they're doing. But I'm stepping out of it now. So, we got a nice little keeper, yellow eye snapper. So, that is, that's my fish. Now, it's Austin's turn. He's gonna drop down and see. Maybe he'll get something different. And then, the taste test is on. I think I missed the photo. Mr. the pole thick then. You hear me? Yeah, Pa. Mr. Paul Thick, and what do you think of this whole thing? I missed a group photo. And leave it, we didn't get to leave it. <laughs> All right, you guys, Jordan just caught this fish. And I'll tell you what, I can't imagine a better place to be than right here. We have one of the prettiest sunsets you'll ever hope to see right there. And we got a full moon coming up over here. We got weed patches coming through. Last night, as I bait this, because we're losing daylight, but last night we witnessed one of the most epic blackfin bites ever. We were just sitting up here deep dropping like we are right now, and we had epic explosions, and it, it was literally insane. So we're keeping our eye open for that right now. So I just caught a scamp on this bottom hook, and it bent the hook straight. Running out of time. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna bend that hook back. And I guarantee you that'll still work. <laughs> That's how we do it in Pencil Tucky. I'm dying to jump in. The moment we left the dock, I kept thinking, I want to jump in. The water's so pretty. Cap frowns on it. But it would be fun, right? Who out in YouTube world would like for me to jump in the water? I know this guy would, right? Cap, you got to wait for me. missing it. <laughs> I'm completely satisfied with that first bite, man. Bro, this is incredible. Heck yeah. So, that was a nice fish. Right? Just dropped right there. Whoa! 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 Oh, oh my god, double! They like the red and white, though. No. You gone? That thing launched out the water. I got that one. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I like it. What? Oh, oh, 
Hey you guys, we're just getting back. Last night we had a big storm blowing in. The wind picked up to about 25 knots, so we decided to come back in. If you or someone you know would like to come do a trip like this, there will be links in the description below to the Yankee Caps and all of these people's social media. This was a trip I will never forget. I wanted to do it since I was 10 years old. Now, I want to do it again. I'll see you guys soon.